the origin of the name Rocket 3 in 1968, the BSA Triumph Motorcycle Group, they were owned, all owned by the same people, in introduced a couple of super bikes, uh, 750cc, and they were three cylinder, which is very, very unique. The Triumph was a Trident, and the BSA was a Rocket 3. So that's the origin of, of the name, which we still use today. When they introduced the uh, three cylinder motorcycles, the performance was so much superior to the twin cylinder 750 motorcycles that it was a superbike. They coined the name superbike because of the speeds. It could do 120 mile an hour plus, which was pretty, pretty amazing in 1968, 1969. And uh, that started the whole superbike theme. It was, uh, it was a pretty good bike at the time, had five speed, uh, went to disc brakes later on. Um, BSA made the Rocket 3 up to 1972. They went out of business, but the Trident went on to 1976. I think the, the speed, the performance, the acceleration, the quarter mile times, the maximum speed, and also the sound of the exhaust, the howl of a three cylinder is very, very distinctive. That helps sales immensely very difficult to work on because there's a lot of pieces. I always, I always told people if you're going to work on a Trident or a Rocket 3 you need three workbenches because there's a lot of pieces in the motor compared with a twin because everybody was familiar with a single or the twin. Uh, they can be very good or very bad and if you get a good one it's, it's a really nice motorcycle. Uh, a good classical motorcycle even today. It introduced three cylinders to to a, a market, to a younger market that were interested in performance. And uh, the Rocket 3, I mean, in that time, you know, we were in the space, space program Rocket, Rocket 3. It's kind of an exciting name. I mean, you could have a lot of dull names. The Rocket 3 still sounds, sounds pretty cool.